think I have a red on my teeth. No? Okay. Okay. And action. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, welcome. My name is Stephanie. Um, so today's video is going to be on this look here. I don't know what I was going with. I just decided to just randomly just do a red lip and then I just, this ended up happening. So I think it turned out great. So if you want to know how I created this look, then please keep on watching. Okay, so I went ahead and did my eyebrows. I did use my um, NYX um, Precision Brow Pencil and this is in the shade Expresso. So yeah, it looks like this. It's a little, the one with the plain um, little tapa. So I went ahead and used that. And then I also moisturized my face with the my Ordinary's moisturizer, which is this one. Um, que limpio la tengo, right? Oh my gosh. Anyways, okay. So I went ahead and did that. Um, I'm thinking of doing like a red lip today. I don't even know. It's so early in the morning, but I want to get this film. Then, you know, just get my day started. So I definitely want to do that. And then the baby's still asleep, so I'm just trying to get this up and running. And then I haven't been drinking coffee, and I was just, like, craving it so much. I'm like, oh, my God, let me get me my coffee. Um, so let's go ahead and get started. I don't want to make this video any longer than I have to. So I think I want to start with, I'm going to go ahead and start with my face. Um, and just do pretty much the usual that I do. Um, and try to speed through this process, because... Um, I do my face all the time and my main focus today is the eyes so and I'm just getting um, the elf putty primer I'm just applying that all over my face oh I went a little heavy it's okay though sometimes I hate doing my eyebrows first because then I have to be really careful not to mess them up but then sometimes I'm just like, oh, it's a lot faster. So it helps. So then I'm going to go ahead and go in with my foundation. This is the LA Colors um, um, Truly Matte Foundation. Oh, you heard my cat sneezing. Oh my god, I love this foundation. And it's so inexpensive. I don't remember what the cost is, but I do like it. Mm. I miss coffee. I really don't drink coffee too much anymore. And I'm trying to I'm trying to cut back on like sugar and stuff. Even though like yesterday I had like a freaking a shit ton of freaking Oreos and shit. Which I only like the the cookie part i don't like the like the oreo part like the um, whatever that's called the white stuff with like the frosting type thing i do not like it i do not like it uh, i'm gonna go ahead and use this to set my under eyes and see how that works kind of it's like so soft oh my god my face i just love it right now i've been definitely moisturizing and like freaking putting like hydrating mask and all that to my face because i have been slacking a little bit and not taking care of the face so i find it was like this you need to get it together you need to get it together take care of your fucking face a little bit better 
so finally i've been like moisturizing and doing all that shit and it's just like oh my god face is just like bomb.com now i'm like bitch yes yes i'm feeling my face. okay so i'm gonna just go ahead and set the rest of the face um but yes my face has just been whoopies just bomb i love it especially since i'm dry i'm like oh my gosh i'm gonna contour the z face okay can I open this? Okay. And we're using my my um Tarte um Park Avenue Princess um uh palette. I'm gonna just say I want the smell of this. Like I really just cannot stand the smell. Like I'm not into these type of scents like um like vanilla -y, um Like, like sweet type of scents. Like, I make como una pinche galleta and stuff, and I enjoy it. Like, I love chocolate, but just the scent of it, like, I just can't stand it. I mean, the good thing it doesn't linger, but that's the only thing I hate about this palette. It's a freaking scent. Like, I'm just like, ugh, can it? Like, hurry up. I don't like opening it because. Yeah, me duele la cabeza. I don't know, como que me, es, me empalaga. Even though I'm not eating it. Hopefully this look some, comes out good. Because I don't even know what I'm doing. Like, I think I'm going to, like, I think, I think I'm definitely going to go in with that red. Like I said. Or did I even say it? I don't even know. But, um, oh my god, is it me? Or is it like, this is so random. But, do y'all get like moquientas whenever you're doing your makeup? Like I feel like I'm getting like freaking moquienta whenever I'm doing my makeup. I'm just like, what the fuck? I'm always moquienta. And I'm like, only when I'm doing my makeup because the rest of the day I'm not. Okay, so I'm going in with, um, with, I like to mix these two shades. Oh, I forgot to do my highlight. I always do my highlight. That's trying to do a little bit of look here anyway so yes i'm always getting freaking moquienta and i'm just like what the fuck like, am i the only one i don't know maybe okay so i'm going in with the highlight and this is just the becca chloe and maliga bff collection or whatever the becca bff of it i always like to do my highlight first but apparently i forgot you see ya voy ya voy ya voy pinche moquienta i feel like it doesn't really blend when i do the blush before like it just sits on top move on to the z eyes let's do that um i think i'm gonna go with the red look i think i'm like in the mood for reds i gato gato can you stop let's go ahead and with my james charles palette and i'm gonna just open it up and use like some browns um i definitely can insert the ones that i'm gonna be using because it's gonna be just too much to carry this okay so I'm gonna go in with the first shade and just apply it to my lids. Go in with the first shade. putting the shades here of which ones I'm using because yeah it's too heavy to carry this shit
Okay, and then I'm going with the darkest color, which is darkening up the crease or the, in the outer corner. Just to blend that out. And then go to the bottom lash line. And just go back with the same shades and just do the bottom lash. The darkest shade, I don't want to take it in all the way, just like in the outer corner here. Just taking my highlight and just apply that on the crease. I mean on the inner corner. And honestly, since I have lashes on, I really don't need to apply, like, any liners or anything like that. I mean, you can if you want, but I really don't feel like I need it. So, I'm going to just apply a little bit of mascara. lip liner but it's downstairs so I'm not like going downstairs to get it so I'm gonna just go ahead and go in these are definitely super inexpensive I did talk about this um in my Ulta haul um that I filmed um I think Sunday I'll link that information I'll link that video down below um uh, because these are super inexpensive I think they're like five bucks I want to say maybe less for, I'm not sure they're under eight bucks for sure soft matte lip cream it is in the shade um, Monte Carlo okay then I'm gonna just go ahead and go in with my uh, revolutions um, setting spray this is a calming makeup fixing spray with cannabis um, sativa and I definitely do like this oh it smells so good like I love this the, the spray and everything it's just bomb i don't recommend it and it's inexpensive it's like i think like 10 bucks i think i suck at remembering prices so guys don't hate me but i'll definitely link you know the information um and pretty much every product that i use i will definitely link that down below um or I include that in my description box is what i'm trying to say but yeah i need to give me one of those little fans So I think that completes the look. I do want to thank you guys so much for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe down below. And I'll see y'all guys in my next video. Bye.